In this video, we're going to solve linear trigonometric equations in sign. It says if 0 less than or equal to theta less than 2 pi, so within one revolution on the unit circle, and negative 4 sine theta plus 6 equals 2 root 3 plus 6, determine the values of theta, list your answers as exact answers in terms of pi, meaning they want that in radians. So we're going to write out the equation, negative sine theta plus 6 is equal to 2 root 3 plus 6. And what we're going to do is we're going to basically uh, treat sine theta as x. So we're just going to pretend that there's an x here, and we're going to do the same algebra steps we would do on a, on a normal problem. So we'll subtract 6 on each side. That cancels out. We get negative 4 sine theta is equal to 2 root 3. And then we're going to divide by negative 4 on each side. And when we divide by negative 4 on each side, we get sine theta is equal to 2 divided by negative 4. That simplifies to, uh, well, it would be negative root 3, because the 2 cancels with the 4, over 2. So then your question here is, typically you take sine inverse on each side, but I like to just look at it right here and say, what would theta have to be uh, to give me a side length of negative th root 3 over 2? So I pull out... Uh, the unit circle, and I say, all right, sine is root 3 over 2 at 60 degrees. But this only occurs when, or we're talking about a negative root 3 over 2. So sine is negative in quadrants, uh, that would be 3 and 4. So we want to find the 60 degree angle in quadrant 3 and the 60 degree angle in quadrant 4. Well, this is really pi over 3. So our our radians in quadrant 3 would be 4 pi over 3. So theta would be 4 pi over 3. And then in radians for our 60 degree mark in the fourth, uh, fourth quadrant, it would be 5 pi over 3. So our solutions are going to be 4 pi over 3 and 5 pi over 3 for theta.